breaking news about hysterectomy and the age of menopause. Between one in five and one in four women can expect to undergo hysterectomy in her lifetime. While there is an increasing trend to leave the ovaries behind due to the health benefits, there's been conflicting data as to how the surgery will affect her remaining ovarian function. This new data finds that on average, a woman can expect to lose her ovarian function through menopause four years sooner with a hysterectomy than without. Hysterectomy will make a woman vulnerable to premature menopause and the adverse health consequences associated with it. Why does this happen? Hysterectomy interrupts a very important blood flow to the ovaries. The ovarian branch of the uterine artery supplies 50 to 70% of the blood flow to the ovaries. And when we lose this blood flow after surgery, our ovaries pay the price. Hysterectomy is a needed procedure, but it's important that a patient understands her risks of early menopause so that she can make adequate decision-making whether or not she goes hysterectomy or maybe a less invasive procedure. Patients who do undergo hysterectomy need to be monitored for menopause sooner rather than later. The average age of menopause remains 51 if it's natural. However, with hysterectomy, we back this up to age 47. And that normal range drops from 41 to 51 years of age with perimenopause symptoms beginning from 31 to 41 years of age.